Welcome to the beach. I'm John, and I promise that this will be a short video. Now, I previously gave these Barbie the Movie dolls made to move articulation and a simple hair makeover. It turned out okay, so for today, I'm gonna be doing the same for these inline skating dolls. Because honestly, these dolls deserve more articulation than what they have now. I'm also gonna restyle slash adjust their hair. Let's go! Here's Barbie's next victim. Per usual, her body donor is this made-to-move doll. The most accessible and perfect match for this Barbie. I wish Mattel would just sell Barbie bodies in different skin tones already. Imagine all the plastic they can save and all the spare dolls we can spare from their fates of being left at the side. These made-to-move dolls are nice on their own though. Now we remove her clothes and prepare for rebodying. Same for our Margot Barbie. Now they're both ready. For this video, I'm going to use this blow dryer instead of warm water. My previous video was a mess with all that water. Pop off! Snatch! Let's place Barbie's head to her new body. And let's dress her first. It all looks good. She just needs another thing. Her old hands. So, the blow dryer wasn't hot enough. Ugh, I guess it's boiling water then. Just gonna dip their hands for a few seconds. Not too long. Just kidding. Here she is with her more elegant hands. I prefer these over the made-to-move hands. Now I cut off these threads and free her hair. I'm just gonna dip her hair in hot water and that's it, just to get rid of the flyaways. Here's her hair. I personally thought her hairstyle was fine. She just needed a hairbrush. Also, I want her bangs to be exposed instead of hidden behind her cap. Her visor cap has an extra part at the top, which I think is inaccurate. So I'm gonna switch this one to a more accurate one. It has no printed details, but it's still pink. See, I think they should have used this cap instead of that big one. Now her hairstyle looks closer to the movie. A simple change really elevated her look. Here's our skating Barbie with all her accessories and a refreshed hairstyle. See how I changed the cap to put her back to the front and suddenly she looks better. Just a small and easy change you can do without doing anything drastic with your doll. Now let's talk about Ken. Actually, there's nothing to talk about. Just some small stuff is also needed. Plus, we'll be rebodying him because I love Ken in a buff body. And looky what we have here. His usual body donor. This is Barbie Looks Ken number 18. He's the only accessible Ken with a buff made to move body. He's not cheap, but he's very accessible. You know, this line really baffles me because sometimes I think of them as glorified body donors. But on the other hand, their outfits are cute and they come with stands, which is nice. Plus, they have gorgeous face sculpts, so I guess they're still worth the price? That's their thing though. The faces on these looks dolls are beautiful. 10 out of 10 across the board. Okay, enough talking. He comes with a stand and a certificate of authenticity. Now it's time to take their clothes off. Now Buff Ken is ready for it. I love the neon accessories for this doll. Skating Ken, here he comes. Off with your head! Yank that! Now placing Ken in his new vessel. Rebodying process successful. Let's give him his clothes now. Ryan Gosling is super ripped in the movie, so I want his doll to also be ripped. I'm not gonna switch his hands this time though. I've already spilled the hot water, plus I think these hands fit his skating getup. His hair needs a refresh. See that? It's glued down like crazy. Might as well be solid plastic. I'm also gonna switch his cap from this one to the small one. 
I dipped his hair in hot water and gave it a comb to restyle it while leaving the product on and still have it manageable. Again, the smaller cap suits them. And I left a part of his bangs outside the cap just to give it a little zhush. He looks good. I'm glad that this simple refresh worked out really well. I'd say he's a tiny bit improved. Side note, his skates are now super snug because the buff bodies have slightly larger feet. It still fits, but look at the sides. Good thing the plastic is kind of soft and stretching. Here they are, Barbie and Ken, rebodied and refreshed. I loved how they turned out. The new visor cap really improved their hair. Well, this was a short video, just a little makeover. I hope you guys had fun hearing my nonsense. If you did, then like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also, follow me on Instagram at John in the Dream House. And as always, see you next time at the Dream House or the Beach. Bye!